morning my dear students welcome to the online class last class we have studied the chapter we have chapter 8 decimals in that exercise 4 uh, sorry exercise 8.4 completed now you have to take the exercise 8.5 here in the first page find the sum in each of the following here you have to find the sum sum means you have to here given the numbers you have to add the numbers means here they not given numbers here they given the decimal numbers okay by using we have to write the first name a question what is there here 0.007 plus 8.5 plus 30.08 okay 30.08 what you are doing here 0.007 the decimal point i think is very important here i read 0.08 writing is very important okay here some means you have to add the following means here 7 8 5 8 3 3 is the value here 38.587 here is the value 38.587 some members taking here 0.007 and here 8.5 whatever here decimal point taking is very Next, take the B value, B question. Here, fifteen plus zero point six three two plus thirteen point eight. Here also add the decimal number. Means here fifteen. They give us the number right fifteen point zero. Fifteen is the number. Fifteen point zero is the decimal number. Next, what is the B value? Zero point six three two. Next thirteen point eight remaining. I said you have to keep the zeros remaining. Zero means nothing. Here is the plus sign is there. You have to write here plus. Next what is there? Add these numbers two, three, six plus eight. What is the value here? Fourteen. Here will be one, four. Next decimal point is there. Write here decimal point. Next here is the value six plus three. You get the nine. One plus one. Two. Here is the value twenty nine point four three two. Okay, again I am telling you have to write the number they give one. You have to convert to the decimal number. Fifteen is the fifteen point zero zero point six three two. You have to write here decimal should be equal. You have to take point saving is very important. Zero point six three two. Next fifteen point eight. Remaining you have to keep the zeros. Okay. Next you have to add the add these numbers. You will get the value twenty nine point. Four, three, two. Next, take the C question. Twenty-seven point zero seven six plus zero point five five plus zero point zero zero four. Zero point zero zero four. Here also take as a big twenty seven point zero seven six. See here zero point five five. That means here zero point five five remaining will be zeros. Next what is there here zero point zero zero four. Here will be zero. Add the following slide the plus. Next what is there this is here six plus four. You get the and take as a and a zero. Next here seven plus one eight eight plus five thirteen. Here write one and three five plus one six. Here is the decimal point. Next here seven two means twenty seven point six three zero is the answer. Okay, like that only you have to solve the remaining three questions D E F. Next take the second main. Here they give one word problems. Okay. Here they give one. Rashid spent rupee thirty five seventy five. Yeah, thirty five rupee seventy five paise for maths book and thirty thirty two rupee sixty paise for science book. Find the total amount spent by Rashid. Here yeah, total amount means you have to do the plus. Okay, write the values in the word form. Rashid spent. Take the second question. 
here what group they given Rashid spent amount Rashid spent amount for match book how much yes rupee thirty five seventy five paise decimal point after you have to read the paise next for science book you have to write here for science book how much money here rupee thirty two rupee here sixty paise thirty two rupee sixty paise for science book find the total amount spent by rashi here write the question mark total find the total amount find the total amount spent by rashi question mark other of find the total amount like that you have to write and write the question mark okay next what do we here total you know the total means what they do here take the balance and add here rupee thirty five point seventy five paisa and rupee thirty two point sixty I say you have to add this you will get the Rashid spent amount okay what is that there five and here thirteen here decimal point eight sixty eight rupee thirty five paisa okay how much Rashid spent Rashid spent amount is equal to Last sentence you have to write this after Rashid spent amount is equal to rupee sixty eight thirty five paise. Okay, like that you have to solve. And next third question here they give one. Radhika's mother gave a rupee ten rupee fifty paise and her father gave a rupee fifteen eighty paise. Find the total amount given to the Radhika by the parent. Here mother how much gave take the balance and father gave amount take both you have to add a piece you will get the value it's a they are radhika parents given amount you have to calculate okay next in the fourth question here they given nasreen bought 3 meter 20 centimeter cloth for her shirt for shirt she bought 3 meter 20 centimeter and for her trouser 2 meter 5 centimeter cloth she bought Find the total length of cloth bought by her. Both you have to add. You will get the value. Here addition is there. You have to solve three, four, five. If you know, if possible, you have to solve the remaining two questions. Okay. I think all of you understood this exercise part. Next, I will do the remaining exercise. Okay. Tomorrow I have to come for correction. Thank you.